there is something I need to talk about. I am in a very difficult situation and I can't keep all these feelings to myself. Last year I made a video where I played the piano for the first time ever. I had fun and it was a big success but a lot of big youtubers pianists didn't like it and they started to attack me for no reason at all. <sighs> I've always said nothing but good words about piano but some pianists still decided to challenge me and roast me. I am sad. Luckily, today we are gonna checkmate them all. Slap like now in this incredibly difficult situation. The first pianist is called Joe. Who is Joe? Joe Jenkins. He made this video. Davey 504 declared war on piano. I don't know what he's talking about. Now, Davey 504 has been insulting the piano time after time for the last few months. Bass was literally designed to be an accompanying instrument. You can't have bass without other instruments as well. Bass was invented by me. All the other instruments were invented by me to support the bass. Get your facts straight. Bass is way better than piano. 100%. You can play any piano song on bass. Easy. Oh really Davy? Oh really? Are you sure about that? Davy 504, I bet you can't play a bass line and a melody line at the same time on the bass. Try and play Jonas theme bass line and Jonas theme melody line. Bet you can't do that, Davey. He said I can't play both the melody and the bass line of John and Giovanna's theme at the same time on bass. Pfft, slap like now, and I'm gonna play it now. <laughs> Epic. Check this out. <laughs> Checkmate. If you put a piano on your legs, it becomes a bass. Oh, that sounds way better than regular piano. Keep playing it like this, please. Because the piano has so many notes compared to bass, you can even play it as a guitar. You know, the fact that you can play the piano as a guitar, something you should be embarrassed about. Guitar is bad. Davy, you're really gonna hate this one, but the piano can even be played as a violin. That's it. This man is just mad. He destroyed the ball. I will never disrespect any instrument to this level. Unbelievable. I challenge you, Davy. I dare you, in fact, to play this E on the bass. I bet you can't because your bass doesn't go that high. You mean this note? Checkmate. I have one more bit of business to take care of. Davey 504, I don't want it to have to come to this. So I'm going to give you one last chance. Back down now, admit the piano is better. Otherwise, I will use this weapon. I will learn the bass and prove to you that the bass is the easier instrument, piano is the superior instrument, and that you suck at bass. He just did a step in the right direction. He bought a bass, hopefully he will give up the piano soon. But in regards to his challenge, I've already played the piano and I learned the song I played in just a few hours. He bought that bass in October 2020 and today, after five months, he still didn't play it because obviously it's extremely hard to learn the bass compared to the piano. Once again, I was right. I bet bass is too hard for you. Joe, checkmate. Let's prank him, go to his channel and subscribe to him. Next pianist, Daniel Thresher. Hey, try doing this on bass, Davey 504. Huh? Or perhaps. I actually like his videos. It was obviously not meant to be taken seriously, and you know. How dare he said that. Now, nah, I've already reacted to this, never already checkmated him. <laughs> 
Daniel Thrasher, or should I call you Daniel Thrasher? Epic Roast. Let's do an epic prank on him too and subscribe to him. Next pianist, Matthias Kranz. He put the bass strings on his piano. If you've been on the music side of YouTube, you know who Davey504 is. He has the biggest bass channel and he's even Italy's biggest YouTuber. But one day I put guitar strings on my piano and after that video you guys gave me an idea that might change everything. I managed to grind through the pain of putting on all of the bass strings on the entire piano I will be able to win. And this is what it actually sounds like. Now it's time to take down the king of bass. At least he has some good art taste. Epic painting here. With the world's biggest bass, I will now play the world's hardest bass solo ever. River flows in you. Davy, I challenge you to a slap battle. And the catch is that every single note I play now is slapped. I'm afraid this is not how slap works. You need to use your hands. Using any other tools to slap the strings is considered cheating. Matthias, you are a cheater. I bet you can't slap an actual bass. Pianist hands are very weak. If they even attempt to play bass thick strings, their hands will just explode. Poor pianist. I'm gonna play that song on bass just to show you that any song on piano will sound even better on bass. Check this out. Which one sounds better, piano or bass? Leave a comment now. Be very careful of your answer. Let's prank him too. Subscribe to him. And you know what? Subscribe to me too. Diamond play button bass reveal at 10 million subs. I've been closely checking all the other YouTube pianists and luckily for them, nobody mentioned my name. If you mention my name, I'm gonna take that personally. All these pianists trying to roast me really made me angry. All the pianists really need to understand what's the real power of bass. So there is one more pianist I want to talk about and he's the most powerful pianist and he's also the boldest pianist on the internet, Seth Everman. In this video he wrote bass and that's just too much for me. I need to destroy him before he gets too powerful. If I destroy him maybe all the pianists will finally take the bass seriously. Seth Everman, I challenge you to a bass versus piano battle now.